Okay, welcome to Activity Chapter 8, Part 10 of Windows Server 2008. This is Configuring Automatic DNS Registration. So in that activity, verify that the DHCP server you have configured is set up to automatically register with the DNS server, the IP addresses that it leases, and then it is configured for the types of clients in your network. So we need to open our DHCP tool. Here in our menu. Okay, we have IPv4 and IPv6. Double click on our IPv4. Select it. There's our scopes and server options. If we right click it, we get a menu of options here. We're going to select properties. And then I'm going to click within our properties the DNS tab. What we want to do is see that enable DNS dynamic updates according to the settings below. That's checked. And it defaults to dynamically update DNS A and pointer records only if requested by the DHCP clients. And then if you have old legacy systems such as Windows NT or 98 for example, you would click this one, always dynamically update DNS A and pointer records since those old operating systems don't they don't work with dynamic DNS. And then you want to make sure that it's checked on discard A and pointer records when the lease is deleted. In other words, when a DHCP lease ends, you don't want these records hanging around clogging up your server. So these are always good to know. And then there's this checkbox here for dynamically updating DNS A and pointer records for DHCP clients that do not request updates. Again, that's for your old operating systems. Anyway, that covers this video, and thanks for watching.